What's up, everybody? It's the Common Sense Investor coming at you with another video. <laughs> I know. I got, I've got all the latest news and updates coming to y'all. It's just that I got a document from somebody in the Discord uh, about the 8K filing update that AMC had done. And before running the press with it, I wanted to research it. And I've talked to a couple of YouTubers. Uh, I talked to Froggy Styles, you remember Froggy Styles, and I talked to Al from Boston because he was the first one that said something about a Disney or Pixar merger or acquisition of AMC. So I wanted to get his opinion about what that document meant, and he gave it to me, and I'm going to be coming with that video soon. But right now, let's do a quick recap. I talked to y'all last night about the process of what happens when... Irvin the investor has bought 73 shares of a ape, all right? And now the price has run up. He bought it at $2. The price has run up to 12 and Mandy the investor wants in. She buys and Irvin sells and the placeholder is erased from one and given to the next on the white paper. We talked about that last night. Just watch the video. Don't want to go through it. It takes too long, all right? But now, the purpose of this lesson was to show y'all what is going on when you bought AMC, that the, how the placeholders are there, okay? But then, after holding AMC for so long, and then an AMC preferred equity unit was given, all right? When that was given, it was given as a split, which... Boy, when this is over with, there's going to be a lot of lawsuits over this, but it's going to have to wait till it's over with. But the purpose of this lesson that, again, it's in the cards, was to show you the process. People, listen, you don't own shares. You own placeholders. All right? I've called these people. I'll talk about that in a minute. But when Mandy bought her 73 shares, she was accredited 73 shares. All right. And as the process worked its way through and the white paper changed its list, Mandy got put on the list and Irvin got taken off the list and this placeholder was removed. Now, Ape was created. Now, when Ape was created, that's where I want to turn to now because I created this infograph last night. Now we turn our attention to when Ape was created. And like I said, I didn't take nobody's word for this, people. If you search my videos, uh, you'll find me with com Colin Computer Share and talking to them because I wanted to understand the process of what was going on. There was so much different information on YouTube. So I called Computer Share and I made that video for y'all. You can go check it out. In fact, I'll put it in the cards too. All right. But what happened when Ape was created was AMC sent the ape to computer share 516 million shares now it was computer shares job to take those shares of ape and disperse them to the different clearing houses okay not the different brokers to the different clearing houses that laid claim to having amc shares all right you gonna understand in just a moment, this is where the fuckery come in overseas. When the overseas people were saying, overseas apes were saying, we ain't got our apes yet. The clearinghouse is over there saying, we ain't got them yet either. Why? Because computer share had run out of ape shares. Now right there is where it should have stopped, okay? When computer share got noticed, that clearing houses were not getting their allotted shares, computer shares should have stopped it right there and let AMC know what was going on and AMC could have filed a complaint with the SEC right then. But they didn't do it. They let it go on. What they done was they dropped them into these clearing houses, they sent out their fucking shields, and boy, I just can't believe one of them. Whenever he said, I've sold all my ape and bought AMC. You know, that's what they were needing because they needed to get those ape shares over to the overseas clearing houses so that they could put the shares in their people's account. 
Now, that's all speculation, hypothetically. Nobody wants to be sued. Shout out to Ken and Grace. Uh, and it's just my opinion from my research. This is what I discovered. All right? But now, this is where we find ourselves. We now know that no matter where you're at, if you're with, say, Weeble, for example, then you're with Apex. All right? So, Apex got a certain allotted amount of shares of AMC, or Ape. And they have put the, on their white sheet who has them, and you're one of them. DTCC did the same thing. They dispersed to the brokerage firms the amount of shares that were allotted to them from the DTCC held in their accounts, and they dispersed it to the investors, which is us. But let's not forget, over in this clearinghouse, you were put on a list and you have a placeholder for this many apes. All right. That's where we're at. Now, however many illegal placeholders there are that are signifying they're not sh their shares there for the investors, well, that only comes out one way, people. And that's when you push that sell button. That if this sum bitch runs and you push your sell button and they have to pay cash for these placeholders it's going to break them now now that we know where we're at with ape and how we got our ape let's do the reverse of it all all right let's say for example because i just watched a video from one particular youtuber who said they're gonna have a ape recall and i'm scratching my head and i'm watching this video and i'm thinking first off i didn't like the title you told me they was gonna have it and I'm listening, and it was strictly opinion. So that blew me off right there from the video. But the second thing is, they don't need to do a share recall, people. When they merge Ape into AMC, that's when you try to fit a square peg in a round hole. Link in the video right there. <laughs> this is why I talk about that. This all goes to shit on them when Ape goes back into AMC and they have more Ape than they have AMC. Now, the shit gets real. That's where we're heading. And as far as the information that I received from the Discord and I had to contact Froggy and I contacted Al and I got all the information lined up for you to tell y'all that's what all this is about. It's about AMC and Ape and what's going to happen if there's a merger or an acquisition of AMC. And I'll talk about that in the next video. Love y'all. Be blessed. See you then. Cold red, there's been a glitch in the matrix. They out here wild and it's too much. I can't take it.